took the rubber bands off. That's what I can screw it up. <laughs> are we still doing this? We are still oh, doing yes. this. You have your mask? I don't have a mask. Well, I don't think I have a mask. Yeah. I can't wear one. You can't come in. I need to one. make a statement. You need to accommodate people with disabilities. You know, it's OSHA and a civil rights thing. If you have a mask, I will wear we, it till I get it. We don't have any masks. I need to make a statement. The board meeting is first before the clock. You can run to CBS real quick and drop off. You have plenty of time. Our, our rules haven't changed. We can't change them. You what? I said the rules, we've been doing this for several months now. I, mean, I know, and that doesn't make it right. And if you look for Scott Atlas, who just made a statement here this weekend, he's on the president's advisory board. He's from Stanford, the Hoover Institute. I've been following him since March, and he says they're totally worthless. I can give you a printout of 45 different articles in major, the major journals, JAMA, New England. I understand your and concern, all of that and is you being, have a right to your opinion. And all of that is but being But I'm just going to say to you, this is our rules, and that's what we have to abide by. I <sighs> Maybe I need to talk on that, too, again. So uh, we're following the wrong rules, and this is just the biggest loss of our liberty has ever experienced. And we're all being made to be submissive robots. Mr. Burr, please. I, I'm, I'm, not, I'm, so, I'm, I'm not just trying, trying to, to educate. You. You know? I, I just have a job to do. I'm not trying to be adversarial here, but okay. this is the rules. So it's been the rules in place for the site the last few months. And that doesn't make it right. And we need the to earth follow used them. to be flat. I understand, but we need to follow them. So if no. you don't have a okay. mask, so who you should can't I? Come in. Who's the health? Who's the health safety officer here? Would that be you? Yeah. Okay. Uh, you come every month. I know the rules. I'm trying to get to the facts behind the rule, the substantiation of why mask. Three percent of the people that got COVID never wore a mask. Seventy-nine percent that wore them always did. So it's like it's more of a. Bob, we're not, we're I'll, not, I'll go out and see if I can wrong. find one in the car. I'll be surprised. Mm -hmm. And actually, you guys are supposed to accommodate people with disabilities, and mine is I can't breathe in an oxygen deficient hazardous atmosphere. And if you guys were wearing the mask as it was attended, you would experience the same difficulty. My background's in atmospheric chemistry, and I've done lots of uh, air testing. I understand, yeah. but you explaining that to me is not gonna change anything. Okay. Maybe, I mean, maybe. It's not, there's nothing I, I can do about it. Well, you can express, you can say that you caught a bunch of flack from a guy that thinks he knows everything and check the data on how masks are. Do not help and seem to hurt. It's the most recent study. 79% of people that wore masks all the time ended up with COVID. The ones that didn't wear it, 3%. Well, if you have one, you are welcome to come in, but if you don't, I can't let you in. Let me see if I can find one. 